Okay, we're gonna start here with a little bit of a thing that you'll see back later. Levante here needs some help, okay? He went at this for a good while, okay? You saw the win streak, but listen to this. He's a little bit of a messed up player, okay? I nearly took him down with three characters, but the minute I get this, and I use a lot of counter style, he got pissed, and he ran off shortly after, okay? This is just me playing who I know how to play, okay? I'm just being a little bit of a jerk about it, but I will. Like, if you go ahead and want to be a jerk, you will get it in return. I don't care at this point, okay? You can be whatever you want to be, but if you want to act like that to me, nah. And you guys saw the moveset. There was Rough Ranger on that thing. So by all accounts, he knows how to freaking do it. But the fact is, he just wants to be a little bit cheap. If you can see it, there is a bit of lag in there. You can see it almost immediately during some of the very specific movesets he pulls. Especially, we actually caught him through it too. When a friend of mine did deal with his... um actions okay so yes we got him yes we did this yes we did that did it matter in the end not really but we had some fun teaching the way so this is what my plan was the entire time anyone who knows my moves that were with anything of my vegetos knows what I'm gonna do okay the fact is this guy basically messed up multiple times and you could tell by looking at it, he was just trying to survive at that point. And as you can see right there, he hit a, he hit a clutch moment too. He didn't know what to do. He didn't know what to do and he knew he was dead anyway. I even gave him the chance to gain that little bit of stamina back. But the minute he went for this ultimate, that was game. The minute he went for it again, he might as well have given up. Okay, guys? Like, really? It's one thing to do it one time. It's another thing to try the same thing twice and still not have it work. Thank you, everybody, for watching that one. I know it was a bit longer than my usual fights. So that's 157 when they're usually about 45 seconds. But, yeah. Okay? Now this one, I'll give this, this isn't so much me catching anything wrong with him. He's just a good overall player and a good person. He just said, hit me. I will not go down easy. And as someone who knows when someone says that they want to have some fun, I'm like, yeah, I'm going to have some fun too. I picked the one of my worst characters in the game I actually play as just because I wanted to have some fun, okay? It's a match between friends, and I'd rather do that than any dealing with any BS or anybody like that. Know what I mean? Okay? It's simple fact. Would you rather have your friend or your, the freaking annoyance? Know what I mean? Okay? God, the 2v2. Okay, so we ran into... Look, this whole thing's going to be a bit longer because I'm going to give you a little bit of background, okay? I'm talking to Cass about something. Somebody shows up, right? They were invited by Cass. That's a whole different thing, right? But, yeah, whole thing goes through. I'm talking about a whole different situation, but, yeah. 
okay so let's see how this goes now from here okay like I said it's gonna take a little bit of time but yeah I'll go back on mic when the guy shows So you're going to see him show up in a few seconds. He shows up and then he walks off, okay? I know Cass likes to go ahead and give people a chance. And I know that's what happened here. Okay? That's just him being himself, okay? Okay? So this guy shows up. I'm talking to Cass. Then he walks out. A few seconds go by and then he re-shows up. Okay? <laughs> There's Lock Your Pockets, Lazy J. Remember these guys because they're running a what I like to call a flipped stats. What they should be is either extremely slow or this or that. And yet they're the exact opposite. I'm going to go silent so the fight can start.
Oh, and in all seriousness, this fight was one of my favorite ones with Cass, but the ending was just so wrong, man. You'll see why soon enough. And this one right here, guys. No mean to be a little bit of a jerk or anything like that, but when you know the person that you pop into a room with and you know them because you blocked them because of past actions this is just too much my old friend Razor has been modding that's wrong dude you know that okay not only has he been modding this is one fight and he has to go ahead and pick a character like Cooler I already know how he is, but this is just something else. Oh, he has saw coming on him. Look at all of this. Look at all of this. Look at how much he does. I mean, it's one thing to go ahead and do this, but then I noticed something about the uh, people in the group. Opposition's a modder too. So on in retrospect, we had everything stacked against us. Four modders, one of them being on our side, then this happens. If you don't know me, okay, I will purposely pick this thing against modders now. Okay, if I find you modding, I will f go ahead and give you a little bit of help. By help, I mean I know you're running one of two super souls, okay? And that's going to be a super soul that's either 100% going to go for healing, right? Like the, the one that's going to go and regen the health. For the whole team, in fact, right? Which is why I'm re-bringing back my Fuji Remote Series Bomb Mode. Which is funny because he knows he can't do anything. And it's even more funny when they realize that. 
But yeah, I'm gonna give him the benefit of the doubt now. And I'm gonna give you this. Tell me if this don't look salty to you. Tell me if this doesn't look salty to you. So not only does this cooler basically go ahead and finish off I and mean, nearly going through all of that for a single one, right? Watch what happens here. As you can see, the other one basically decided to get in on it by having a charge key blast ready. Who does this? And then this fight started, and I was ready to end it all, okay? This is after the last fight that showed up there. After we caught them, or after I caught them and ran off, okay? This fight was just pure insanity, because I've been checking these characters in the lobby. I've been checking their boxes, everything. And what's the funniest part is, he can't do one very funny thing. I don't think anyone can. And it's funny because he's running the Super Soul I know he was going to run. I didn't, I wasn't even trying to go ahead and hit him there either. I'm just trying to get him to waste some bullshit stamina, right? And get my key back how I can. Funniest thing is, I got him with the, out of the, out of the freaking thing he had. So out of his super soul, which is funny enough already, and I should have kept it going there, but yeah, I wanted to test if I could actually hit him. Funniest thing is, I can. Okay, I took a bit of damage here to get more out of it, but yeah. And as you can see, the model still appears as a huge one. And there's one. There's... Okay. This is actually funny, guys. Okay? He's starting to get mad. Right? Look at how many perfect blocks I did on him this match alone. I just needed that key back at least. But yeah. This is going to be funny, though. So he does this. And then he decides to start the biggest troll off ever. One perfect block off of a fan crash. Block that. Right? Perfect block. Per block, 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 perfect block. It's like, hey, uh, do, what are you aiming at, really? Right? One, two. Nope, nope, nope. One, two. I mean, how much did I actually need to do? And then I figured this out. The giant mod is also health modded. So all you need is really a few hits and that's game. It doesn't matter after that. And look, he's still trying to troll here, but yeah, I already know I could have taken him anyway. And what's funny, I keep up my own blocks. I was just being a pendejo at this point. I wanted to see him freaking get mad. I wanted to see him get mad. 
and yeah as you can see all of this is clipped into it but those blocks alone prove that thing is not completely broken okay so this is what I did yesterday I went ahead checked through everyone I could okay guys so everyone I had seen with some form of lag switch or mod or something I caught him first up Tesla while his uh, this account may not seem like it he modded his character stats this was also the one that was using the giant Namekian Let, let's leave it at that right guys like what is wrong with you bro okay what is wrong with you but yeah l l let's uh, keep it moving from here I have it at quarter speech or put it at half but yeah as you can see they cut off a lot of the stuff on things they just reset the stuff that I think is part of the latest update as well they just reset you so then next up I will put oh yeah okay so there's all of that right right up to Otsu okay first up Otsutsuki world this is an odd one guys okay so Otsutsuki world does not have much in terms of mods but he is known for playing cheap and here comes an, an old friend of mine if you know him Asian man Asian man oh he doesn't go ahead and go through he seems to be holding a grudge I don't blame him I'm not wrong for it I'd rather go ahead pass it on and be like hey let's go back right now this one was lock your pockets lazy J right both of these bro came up in a duo match okay I'm gonna give you this this is what you call reverse the mod okay while he may seem like he should like he should be real freaking slow and all that he actually got a flip script him and his friend Lazy J have what is known as a flipped stats everything that should be in reverse will go through that this guy likes to go ahead spam that power rush off the twice okay here's the other one so Rex875 this guy also likes to spam certain moves but if you want to look closely he's, a, he's actually a good player not really that much outside of being super freaking cheap okay so let's keep it going keep the list going down right oh Levante Levante boy this man right here doesn't just flip mod okay he doesn't just reverse the mod he has fucking cheap he's cheap player trash player and he uses that reverse flip on everyone he goes up against funny enough he'll even lag switch so he can get more out of it now here's the one that I've been waiting to show all this time tank D gamer the man has skill but if you go ahead and beat him a few times he'll be sure to go ahead and come back at you with a lot of salt you're asked you're talking to someone who did take him down three times with three separate characters and he went all salty on me but yep that lets us see it keep on going right like I said watch out for this one and let's see what happens from there right let's see what happens like dang how much are we gonna go for how much you actually gonna go before you figure out hey you're gonna lose everything before you gain anything boy thank you for going ahead watching and I'm gonna be right back to my own games thank you okay and some uh, special news there will be a new intro with more gaming related movies and all that in there at this point and hopefully I will get it done by within the next few weeks thank you